Yo, what's going on guys? Professor here, back again with another video. In this video guys, I'm gonna be playing this Minor Poison Fast Cycle Double Evolution deck and I'm currently 2812 with it in the entire world. And also guys, shortly before I start the video, I just want to mention that I just created my own clan guys and if you guys have 4000 trophies, you're doing daily war and you're regularly active, feel free to join. You're welcome to the clan and without any type of further ado, I'll see you guys in the first match. I'm on the first game here facing Zik, Zik. So let's see what you're playing. Gonna start the game by uh, playing my skeletons and then go warbreakers. Like that's the main thing guys have to be doing. You have to cycle your skeletons and uh, warbreakers to get back to your evil forms, to evil skeletons and evil warbreakers. And okay, this guy got skeleton dragons and warbreakers. Really interesting. Yeah, really interesting deck at his end. I don't know what is he running to be honest. So, but we'll see. So we're go I'm gonna poison the little prince. It's a little bit aggressive. I'm gonna be down like yeah, I'm gonna be down four elixir with that. But mm, I would say like I'm pretty sure that he cannot support the recruits. So that was kind of aggressive. But those goblins are not gonna do anything. So I'm gonna just log. I miss one of the goblins. Unfortunately, that's some um, nice damage for him, but it's fine. So okay. So yeah, and the deck guys, we got evil warbreakers and evil skeletons. You guys can also use evil knight if you wanted to. If you don't have evil warbreakers. That's going to also work. And um, I am pretty sure that this is going to be the best deck to use for the next season after the balance changes. Because Evo Skeletons didn't get any type of nerf. And also same as Evo Warwakers. Poison didn't get any nerf. Even though a lot of people were asking for a Poison nerf. The Poison didn't get nerf. And um, yeah, the only card that got nerf was um, Low Prince. Which... The range got a little, like the range, yeah, the range got nerfed. But I guess it's going to be still really strong. But yeah, we'll see. If it was like not really good, Arch Queen is always a really, really good replacement to it. So yeah, we can also use Arch Queen next season. But yeah, we'll see. So I'm going to lock in then Skeletons. I guess lock Skeletons should... Okay, one of them connects. That's fine. I could have played my Bomb Tower, but I just want to see that. If it's possible to counter them with log and skeletons. So he's running really interesting evil recruits, evil warbreakers with fishermen, skeleton dragons, arrows, LP. Yeah, really interesting deck this guy got. I'm gonna go knight like this and I'm gonna go miner to protect my low prince to get as much as value as I can out of it. And okay, interesting ability it is in. Hmm. But his little prince is snapping mine, so that's kind of good for him. I'm gonna go skeletons like this and then bomb tower. And these full recruits are a little bit trouble. Um, I guess, yeah, I'm fine. He got some damage, but it's still okay. I don't want to waste my log. I'm gonna just go for my. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's arrows out of hand, so I'm gonna go evil skeletons like this. But he has skeleton dragon. That's a little bit annoying. Gonna go miner. No, we didn't get on time down. So, I'm gonna poison the low prince, I guess. Hmm. The Gordon's on the tower, though, but that's like, yeah, that's not a lot of damage. I I, I already have a lot of damage on the right hand lane tower. Gonna go knight like that. Skeletons. Uh, bomb tower. Sure, I guess. Yeah, I need the low prince. I need the low prince. Warbreakers to kite everything backwards. Uh, this matchup is not looking so good, to be honest. He, he got a lot of answers. Like, he got arrows, goblins, skeleton dragons. And yeah, he got really good spam as well. Hmm. Uh, okay, I don't have my ma and my poison in hand. I'm, I guess I'm gonna just pop the ability and go wallbreakers because the guardian is gonna be thanking for them, and they might connect, right? Ah, barely. But 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 I got splash damage out of them, so that's something at least. And gonna evil skeletons, miner. Oh no, I have to go bomb tower. And uh. Uh, yeah, I have to play my low prince. No, I don't have to. Oh, we're fine. Gonna go war because and then prediction log for the goblins. We got the recruits, but we're not gonna get any connection, unfortunately. I'm gonna just play my low prince like this and then poison his low prince. He, he also got fireball. I, I, did he play his fireball? I haven't seen him play the fireball uh, like until now. So I'm gonna go war because here and then I'm gonna. Hmm, and the low prince. I really wish that I had my log in hand over there. So I guess I'm gonna go for my minor poison and then knight like this. I have to be aggressive with my minor poison because 
30 seconds left and if i don't be aggressive like that i'm pretty sure i'm gonna lose gonna go minor again and then a knight off to the side i guess i'm gonna go bomb tower wall breakers to tank you know just play them defensively because i don't have any other choice i'm gonna just go naked minor on his tower knight for the low prince lock the wall breaker away and five seconds remain i guess we won oh wait the low prince uh, okay, we're fine. That seemed kind of scary for a second, but yeah, we've got it. So, really nice one right there against Evil Recruits, Evil Warbreaker spam deck, and I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm on the next game here, facing Moogie. I don't know if this guy's uh, the real Moogie or, I don't know, fake one, so we'll see. So, he's running Kennedy. I'm going to go Skeletons. He has Evil Skeletons and Evil Bomber. I really hate to see these two go together because it's always a drill deck. Uh, yeah, he got poison, of course. I'm gonna go knight. Oh no, he got a hit. The knight was a little bit late. Hmm. I'm gonna go wall breakers. He got minor. Wait, he got minor poison. Log ice spirit with evil bomber and evil skeletons. Interesting. Also, guys, um, I just wanted to ask you guys that that uh, do you guys want me to? play the challenges for you guys for example if there is a new challenge comes out like like i don't know catch the sparky challenge which is right now in the game and soon there is they're gonna release a challenge where you can get season tokens out of it i just want to ask you guys do you guys want me to play the challenges like uh yeah give you guys some tips and tricks and show you guys the best deck that and how to play it and how to get the wins and I'll be happy if you guys answer me that in the comment section. Because I've seen some YouTubers doing that. Like they post videos on, yeah, when a specific challenge releases, they're going to post a video about it and show how to play the challenge. And yeah, I just wanted to ask you guys if you guys are interested in that or not. So, or if you guys just, or, or you guys want to just see uh, ladder gameplays. So yeah, make sure to answer me that on the comment section i'll i'll be i'll be really happy so i'm gonna go low prince off the side i want to give him ice spirit damage seems like this guy's running minor poison control but he got evil bomber and he doesn't have evil knight i guess so hmm, he's running evil bomber instead of evil knight really interesting gonna pop the ability here i'm gonna go also log prediction for the skeletons we didn't get any skeletons but we got some nice damage on this tower that's what matters I'm gonna go skeletons here and then minor. This matchup is his matchup 100% because he got ice spirit, which is going to retarget my minor. And also, he got much, much faster cycle <laughs> than me. And yeah, I cannot do anything about this minors right now. As you guys can see, just go minor poison and, and, and I can't do anything. Uh, wait, the wall breaker is disconnected. Wow, this guy. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be poison. I was not expecting the wall breakers to connect, but yeah, we got it. So, pretty nice win right there against Minor Poison Control Deck with Evil Bomber. So, yeah, four seconds remaining. I'm just going night like this, you know, just to be safe. And I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm on the next game here facing this guy. So, let's see what he's playing. I can't read his name, unfortunately. So he got ice spirits. I'm gonna just go for my ice spirit bats. Interesting. I'm gonna go skeleton like this so the bats don't do too much damage to my tower. Uh, ice spirit bats with goblins. Hmm. What is this? He got log. It 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 can be minor, like yeah, minor bat cycle deck. But this guy got oh he got more. Okay. I'm gonna go low prince and then I'm gonna pop the ability. So the mortar is pretty much dead. So he's running really weird mortar deck. Like yeah, mortar with firecracker, goblins, ice spirit, bats. Interesting. Hmm. I'm gonna. I guess I'm gonna just play my bomb tower if he plays anything else to activate my king. But so I'm gonna go bomb tower. Is that gonna activate the king? Uh, yes, it did. Perfect. I'm gonna just go warwick like this to counter that, and then go skeleton just in case if he counters the. You know, if he logs the Warbreakers, which he did. So, hmm. 
what is it gonna do uh i can i i guess i have to lock the motor but i don't want to because Mm, yeah, I guess I should have locked the firecracker and the motor anyway. But it's still fine. It doesn't matter too much. Uh, okay, he's up like two elixir, I guess. But it doesn't matter. I'm just go minor and then wallbreakers to kite the goblins backwards. Hopefully we do that. Perfect. He wins Valkyrie. He might go for the... Yeah, he's going to go evil motor at the bridge. Pretty sure about that. Uh hello okay he didn't i have a really bad psycho oh no <laughs> bro i want to play my evil skeletons dude this guy's trolling me right now i had a really really uh you know funny car cycle over there so i just wanted to i wanted to you know pull the valkyrie backwards with the evil skeletons but they accidentally play my poison over there so it's still fine though. it doesn't matter too much we're still alive so I'm gonna just go for my miner like this and then a knight on top of his firecracker. Okay. I'm gonna just go wall breakers opposite lane. I don't know. And then poison the firecracker. Um what is he gonna do? He's gonna go Valkyrie. Wait, he didn't. I'm gonna pop the ability and then I'm gonna prediction lock for the goblins. Uh ah, I barely got those goblins down. Wait, wait, wait. He's gonna go okay. I knew he's gonna go more. I wanted to play my bomb tail a little bit fast, but yeah, he was a little bit quick with that uh, motor placement. So, gonna wallbreakers like this, so the motor doesn't hit my tower. And the wallbreakers are gonna bang, bang, connect. Which is quite nice. And then we're gonna log this away. Knight. Um, hmm. I guess I'm gonna go low prince and then poison on defense. That's the best thing to do, I guess. And then I'm gonna wallbreakers like this, so the motor does not connect to my tower. Minor his tower, and one of the wallbreakers are gonna connect. No, it didn't. Oh, the right hand lane did. I was talking about the left hand lane. I'm gonna go bomb tower prediction. Yeah, perfect prediction over there. The evil motor is dead, I guess. Nope, it's not. Okay, gonna poison it so it dies, and then low prince. Ah, good poison. That isn't really not the best low prince at my end, to be honest. I just played it in the poison range. Um. Gonna go mine of wallbreakers and then I'm gonna predict the goblins. Okay, we did predict the goblins though. <laughs> yeah, we still got the goblins down, so that's what matters. Uh I guess I'm gonna Ah, really bad ability mine. I don't know why I popped the ability. That makes that made it no sense. I just waited I just wasted three elixir for nothing. Uh okay, gonna poison that. And that firecracker is not gonna hit my tower, alright? Uh yeah, it did for one shot, but not yeah, the second shot did, the first shot didn't. So, gonna go low press like this, knight in front of it, and then I'm gonna go Warbrick's opposite lane, poison, miner. If the miner connects to the tower, it's game over. Uh, Yeah, it's pretty much game over, I'm pretty sure about that. That's gonna be locked, so... Yeah, really nice win right there against Evil Mortar, Evil Firecracker deck, and I'll see you guys in the next match. I'm on the last game here, facing... Asterix 07 from Robert's Army. So let's see what he's playing. He got really good finishes as well, not gonna lie. So he seems like a really, really good player. Gonna log here. The hog is gonna take two. Gonna get two hits. It is what it is. Hog is broken. Hashtag nerf hog. So gonna go minor like this. Predict goblins or skeletons or anything. Okay, he got, he got Barbaro. Wait, he's running... He's running hog EQ, right? But why does he have board, bro? Hmm. Gonna log like this and skeletons to potentially activate the king. The firecracker just stayed there and did nothing. So it's fine. This guy's running Barber. I guess he's running Barber instead of the log, which is really interesting, to be honest. Not gonna lie. Gonna go for my Warbreaker split. What is he gonna do? Skeletons and then Barber. Good Barber it is in. I have to play my knight for it, otherwise he's gonna get a hit. So, I have no idea why this guy running Barbaro, but, you know, he has really good finishes, so. He knows something that we don't, I guess. So, the hog is not going to get a hit, which is, yeah, quite obvious. I'm going to activate my king over here, which is the most important thing in this matchup, having uh, an activated king. Going to go evil skeletons dual lane with evil warbreakers. 
Uh, oh, one of them going to went to the tower. Yeah, perfect. One of them went to the tower and connected. We got a connection, which is great. Going to go for my little prince. So, hmm. I'm going to just go for my knight at the bridge to predict evil firecrack or something. So, okay, I'm going to just go for my miner on his tower because the knight is tanking. I can poison as well in here, but I don't want to. I'm gonna just cycle my log, I guess, yeah. And then I'm going to pop the ability now, and then I'm gonna go for my. Okay, I wanted to go for my Warbreakers, but the Guardian is already on the tower for two hits, which is perfect, though. And okay, so I guess I have a really bad cycle right now. I have to fix my cycle as soon as possible. Otherwise, if he goes Hog, I'm dead. Uh, okay, my cycle is pretty good right now back again like yeah i didn't i was four cards away from my bone tower and he was like one two card away i guess from his hog so yeah and yeah he's already back to another hog which kind of sucks but bomb tower last second thank you saved me over there gonna go wall breakers you might pop the ability here mm, okay really good i spirit is in not gonna lie so I'm gonna just cycle my log here. It's evil skeletons. Evil skeletons are gonna be really helpful in here, yeah. So I'm gonna play my miner to tank for them. He can Barbaro, but he wait, why did he play evil skeletons? Okay, I'll take the win there. And if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like and sub and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.